In these problems, we've got a monomial, that is something with one term outside the parentheses, and a trinomial, that is something with three terms inside the parentheses, and they're asking us to rewrite this without parentheses. Really, this is just a problem about distribution. When two things are next to each other, one of them is in parentheses, we're multiplying. Since this has got three terms inside, we have to multiply this by each of these three terms. And the only tricky part here really is that we've got some negative signs to watch out for. So the first part of this problem, let's just do this times the first term here. We've got a negative six u squared times a negative four u squared. And I'm gonna do this a part at a time. First, let's just look at the negative signs. A negative times a negative is gonna be a positive. So it's a positive. Then we have the number part, six times four would be 24. And then we have u squared times u squared. Well, when we have the same bases and we're multiplying, we add the exponents. So two plus two is four. So this would be u to the fourth. So that's our first term, 24 u to the fourth. Let's try the second term, negative six. Let's do the number part first. Negative six times a negative nine. That's gonna be a positive 54. And this time we have u squared times u. Remember, this is u to the first power. When we, when we see just a, a plain old u, it's u to the first. So we add the exponents, two plus one is three. So this is u to the third power. And finally, negative six u squared times two, well, that's just negative 12 u squared. Let's try one more just for practice. So again, we're gonna distribute this by multiplying by each of these terms. So first, negative eight times a negative four, that's a positive 32. And then x squared times x to the third, we add those exponents, two plus, two plus three is five, so that's x to the fifth. Second term, negative eight times a negative six is a positive 48. And x squared times x, this is x to the first, so we add the exponents, we get x to the third. And finally, negative eight x squared plus five, that's a negative 40 x squared. So that is how to multiply a monomial by a trinomial.